Kuzu Zangbo, welcome to Bhutan e-learning project. I am Kile Bida from Mendagang Primary School of Punakha Zongkok. This is a mathematics lesson for Key Stage 1, classes PP2-3. Topic for today's lessons are Days of a week, months of a year, calendar, and seasons. At the end of this lesson, you should be able to number one, name and write seven days of a week. Number two, name and write the 12 months of a year. Number three, read a calendar. Number four, name the four seasons and the months they fall in. Okay, children, there are seven days in a week. Let's look at this. They are Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Would you like to repeat after me? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Now it's your turn to name the days of the week monday all right children now you know that there are seven days in a week let's look at months of the year there are 12 months in a year they are January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Would you like to repeat with me? Let's say the names of the months once again. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Okay, children, now you try to name the 12 months by yourself. Well, children, we just finished learning names of the days and 12 months of the year. I would like you to write down these names in your notebook. Okay children, let us try to read a calendar now. Look at this calendar. You will see all the 12 months here. Can you read the names of the month? January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Let us look at one of the months. For instance, January. How many days are there in this month? Okay, there are 31 days in January. What day falls on 1st of January? Yes, Wednesday. Now, how many weeks are there? There are 4 weeks in every month. Remember that there are four weeks in a month. Now, let's see how many Sundays are there. Let's count. One, two, three, four. So there are four Sundays. Now, it's your turn to look at a calendar and solve this question. Let's look at February month. What day falls on 1st of February? How many weeks are there? 
How many Saturdays are there? How many days are there? Yes, February and the year 2020 has 29 days. But usually February has 28 days only. When we have 29 days in February month, we see it as a leap year. This leap year comes every after four years. This year, 2020, is a leap year. So, when is the next leap year? Count in your finger. 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024. So, our next leap year will be on 2024. Okay, children, now look at the calendar again. And you have to solve this question in your book. Look at each of the month of the year, number one. You have to write down which month is it. Number two, you have to write down how many days are there. Number three, what day falls on first day of each month? Number four, how many weeks are there? And number five, you have to count how many Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Thursdays, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays are there in each month. Okay, children, we have learned seven days of the week and 12 months of a year. These 12 months are divided into four seasons. They are spring, summer, autumn, and winter. Now, let us look at spring. Spring months, we see lots of new flowers and leaves. Spring falls in March, April and May. Now let us look at summer. S during summer we see lots of leaves and it is hot and we have lots of rain. Summer months falls in June, July and August. Now let's look at autumn. During autumn we see the leaves turning yellow and the months are September, October and November. Finally, we have winter. During winter, it is very cold and we see very few leaves on the trees. Winter falls in December, January and February. So, I would like you to draw the seasons and write the names of the months in your notebook. Well, children, that brings us to the end of this lesson. Let's recollect what we have learned. Number one, days of a week, 12 months of the year, calendar, and four seasons. Thank you and see you in our next lesson.